Okay, a work in progress uh, here. Uh, two Royal Star Ventures. This is a 2008 <coughs> that I'm in the process of converting. I've removed the trunk and uh, cut the tangs off. And I've ordered a bib that's going to go over the back fender here. And I've got a chrome rail luggage type rack that's going to go on there too. Uh, I should finish it out. This bike here... Uh, I've added, of course, that Harley light kit, LED, the rail system, the diamond cut guy provided me with all the good accessories here that you can see, including the front rail, got a pasture light set up, uh, and more diamond cut stuff, pegs. So <laughs> been a work in progress. Uh, and I've changed this out to Delkovich uh, pipes uh, to give it a little bit more rumble, a little more sound. Uh, I finished the installation uh, today on my Orlo horn here, installed using Larry's adapter kit. You know, so, and this of course is that tank bra that I bought uh, on eBay. Had to replace that audio control unit. Uh, from time and age, it cracked. The plastic was all cracked. And just picked up the 2013. Uh, was uh, actually fortunate to find this. Uh, down in Madison, Mississippi. Uh, the bike had uh, 12,000 miles on it. And uh, I pretty much got it loaded out with a GPS uh, cup holders. A Wolo horn mounted a little bit differently, more cup holders. This is pretty much uh, foot pegs, pretty much a pristine bike, uh, fairly new. Uh, I got it at 12,000 miles, it has 13,000 miles, and uh, it's a full version, so one of each. And uh, kind of uh, like this. Uh, conversion process going on. Kind of a neat ride. Takes about 30 pounds off the bike. And then last but not least, I've got my Kawasaki 1700 uh, Voyager. Very nice bike. A lot of torque. Uh, kind of decked it out with uh, GPS and different things I've been adding gradually. Uh, this is 2018. I went ahead and put Polk uh, upgrade uh, on the uh, speakers I uh, used five and a quarter inch and they've been installed and I did go ahead and finish the upgrade on these uh, LED lights using engineer adapter kits that was quite a process uh, and there's videos on all of this uh, that's my aux lights and then I bought that adapter kit also to change out the headlight I also have a modulator on this front headlight so I bought these Harley protectors and put on my bike here, crash bar protectors, uh, one on each side. Uh, knock on wood, this bike has not been down, uh, but I've fallen on many a bike over the years. Usually just a short tip over, nothing too serious. Had one probably more serious incident. Got some scars to show for that, but hey, you get up and you ride again, so anyway, there's videos on a lot of these installations and things that I've been doing. I've been posting them to make it easy for anybody that wants to do the same. So, hope you enjoy.